Hey, how's it going? Thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch this video that I made for you. Um, this video is going to give you an idea of your position on Google and if new prospects in the area can find you when they're looking for a gym in Encinitas. All right, so this is your SEO analysis. Um, as you can see, we're on one of my business pages. My company's AMP Local. We do web design, SEO marketing, uh, PPC management, and lead generation. All right, so I just want to jump straight into the video. So as we can see, we're on the... Uh, website for LA Fitness and Encinitas. Um, so Google has an algorithm, right? It has 200 determining factors. I'm not going to go into all of those. I'm going to go into four of the very most important ones. Um, it's important to understand this because 82% of the population is on Google when they're looking for a product or service in their area. Uh, so if you understand this, to be at the top of those searches can be very rewarding to any business owner that has a website, okay, or a corporate business. Um, so to find LA Fitness, naturally, someone would want to type in things like gym or fitness club or fitness center, okay, things of that nature. They don't, they, maybe they just moved there or maybe they're deciding to start, you know, getting in shape this year or they have a wedding in a few months and they need to join and get a membership, right? Um, and they don't know what's around. So they, they'll type in these general words looking for a, a fitness club like you guys, all right? So one of the most popular ones is gym, just the word gym, okay? And another one is fitness center. So I'm going to show you where you guys are at with those two words, okay? Um, so gym Encinitas, um, so Google's very smart. They're not always going to type in Encinitas. So if, they just, if, they're in an Encin if they're in Encinitas, the city of Encinitas, and they type in gym, Google's going to know the location and give them the most relevant searches. So that's why you guys want to be at the top. So... Since I'm here um, doing this uh, from San Diego, I'm typing in Jim Encinitas, okay? So, uh, as you may already know, this is your ads. About 30% of your clicks come from there. Maps, about 35% or so. Um, and the organic, about 30 to 40% of all the clicks come from here. So, for Jim Encinitas, you guys aren't in the maps, in the top three anyway. Um, and then as far as the organic, you're not on the first page, okay? Let me click the second page. Uh, LA, LA, LA. Still don't see LA Fitness. Still no LA Fitness. So I usually don't even go that far. If you're not on the first page, you might as, be, might as well be on the 20th page because 91% of the clicks come from there. So the ones that that's really killing it for you guys is the 24-hour fitness club in Encinitas. Okay, they're number one in the maps and they're number four in organics all right so fitness center however you guys are number two in maps and number nine organically okay so not too bad um and you are a two point two a two star out of five star business and they're a three and a half star business okay just throwing this out there um we can get you um legitimate reviews uh from uh from clients that are coming to the gym so there's ways that we can do that um, so we can eventually get you guys to a four or five star business alright so this is what the clicks look like coming from those spots so I just want to show you this so if you're number one you're getting around 30 35 percent of all the clicks you know for the maps and the organic you guys at number nine are getting maybe six or seven um, around three or four percent okay so significant difference uh, moving up in the ranks so we definitely want to get you guys moving up there to take some of that market away, right? So, keyword planner, um, the word gym, I, I mentioned this earlier, gets searched in Encinitas around 1,600 times a month on average. All right, so how much of that pie are you guys really taking? So that's kind of what I wanted to show you um, as far as that goes. Uh, fitness center, all of these keywords um, is something that we're definitely going to get into if we... Uh, do business, um, all of these keywords is definitely something that we want to make sure you guys are at the top of. So Fitness Center gets around 1,200 to 1,300 searches a month. Um, so a lot of potential there, you know, like I said, how much of that pie are you guys really taking? Um, so 24 hour versus LA Fitness. So this is how many clicks the two businesses now, they're big corporate with many locations across the country. Um, I really just wanted to show you this uh, to show you that 
you're they're getting more clicks than you. They're around four hundred thousand, while you guys are around three hundred sixty thousand a month. Um, but the thing that you guys are lacking in is uh, PPC management. You all, you only pull in about a hundred clicks a month from that. This is real corporate, um, and then they're pulling like ten thousand. So I don't know if that's something that LA Fitness needs to consider. It's definitely something they need to consider because there's a lot of money in the in the AdWords campaigns. Um, a lot of potential prospects you can walk and get in the door um, from that. So yeah, 24 hour is killing it a lot more than you guys. That that location they're taking in way more of the prop of the uh, potential prospects in Encinitas for sure. Uh, just looking at your rankings. Um, so let me talk about the four determining factors. All right, that I want to get into that go really goes and drives the SEO marketing campaign. Um, the first one is authoritative content. So when we go to this page, is there authoritative content relevant to, you know, gyms or fitness clubs or sports clubs and things of that nature in Encinitas? So this is the page for Encinitas. So for this website, there's not much going on. Um, there's just a few uh, bulleted, you know, this is what we offer our amenities. You know, this is the pricing, and, and that's pretty much it. Um, if you guys really wanted to... And half, this is all about keyword research. We need to add at least a thousand to two thousand words about the club on these uh, landing pages, you know, because there's different clubs all over the country, right? So the, each landing page has to have uh, keyword research built into it with at least a thousand words per page. All right. So for your club, the reason why you guys are lacking so far in the organic rankings is this is main one of the main problems. Um, let me show you what authoritative. I do this with all my. Uh, clients. Let me show you what authoritative content looks like. I typed in elephant. Wikipedia is always number one for these type of searches. Why? Because they're authoritative content. Endless information, like 50,000 words about their habitat, their evolution, where they come from, what do they eat, um, everything. Okay. But again, uh, this is excessive. Like I said, just 1,000 to 2,000 words. And that's something we could definitely get written for you. Um, next, I'm going to talk to you about business listings. We also call these citations. Um, these are very important. This is how we get our name out on the internet. Some examples are Google, Yahoo, Facebook, Bing, Yellow Pages, White Pages. I'm sure you heard of these. When you do them, you have to have your business name, address, and phone number identical because Google, if not, Google's going to slap you down. So these are directly responsible for getting you listed um, number one in the maps right here. Okay. So right now you guys are at a 25% error rate, which is, is which is huge. Okay, so you're not listed like in some of these map quests. These are top 50 in the country, by the way. Your name is varied, and some of them, again, you're not listed. You have the wrong phone number right here. Um, so all of this are big errors that Google is slapping you guys down for, and definitely not being listed is a huge problem. There's thousands of these things. We want to get you listed in hundreds and hundreds over time. Um, so great thing about doing business with me and Amp Local we can actually look up all the citations for each business. All right, so look at this. Here's LA Fitness. All right, this is your branch. This is lo your location, 164, okay? 24-hour fitness, they have 106, uh, 106. Now, here's the thing. They're, the reason why they're killing it on the rankings is because their citations are more local-based, okay? I was reading through them. These are more popular. People are searching through these more often for a local gym than a lot of the ones that you guys are listed in. So we can literally go in here and list you guys in all of these, okay? So that's one beautiful thing about uh, knowing where they're listed in, okay? So very, very powerful strategy right here. Next, I want to talk to you about backlinks, okay? So say you guys, you know, I'm sure you guys change people's lives all the time. People come there and meet their fitness goals. You know, say they're so impressed they have a website or a blog or write articles, they'll actually write an article on their website and mention you guys. So anyone reading that article can click the link to you and now you have a new prospect, maybe somebody that wants to join the gym. This is great for you, but most importantly, Google sees this as a vote. All right, Google's a big popularity contest. All right, the more votes you have, the more uh, chances you are of winning, the, like running for president, right? So, um, this is where you're at right now. I was on your competitor, 24-hour fitness. Um, Y'all's trust. So let me show you what these numbers mean. Um, referencing domains. This is saying there's 160 websites mentioning LA Fitness 916 times. And this is on the globe. This is corporate. 
okay this is corporate um, but definitely you know stuff rolls downhill if you know what I mean right so this is corporate 916 mentioning from 160 domains okay and the trust flow this is most important this is the quality of these domains all right so let me show you this chart at a trust flow of 18 you guys are meeting medium quality but not so high quality okay so you're right in the middle here on while your top competitor 24-hour fitness is crushing it almost 3,000 websites mentioned them 65,000 times obviously they're a lot bigger company um, but that just shows you how much more potential there is to grow as long as you have the right SEO marketer pushing uh, your your business online okay so their trust flow is 43 all right so again showing you this chart they are very high quality off the charts okay now what's great about us is that we have unlimited resources of uh, supporting influence pages to link you guys to all very very high trust flow 30 35 plus um, which is gonna eventually bring you in the top rankings for uh, the organic this is the this is the key determining factor for the organic rankings okay is the uh, backlinks so right now you guys are very low all right so to move you guys up to within the top three will be very very easy when we start doing um, SEO marketing because right now for like Jim you're not even in there we would have to build keyword research get that word mentioned on the home page and then push to the SEO to move you guys up now for words like fitness center in Sanitas you know moving you from LA from number nine to up to number three and number two it will be very easily attainable um, because they they are a powerful uh, competitor but we pretty much this is how we dominate is just by reverse technology um, sorry reverse engineering alright so we figure out what they're doing and just do more okay so that's exactly what I'm doing here so that's backlinks last thing I want to talk to you about is being mobile friendly so 60 80 percent of the population is on go on uh, their iPhone or Android so you must look good on a mobile device all right um, most importantly you know Google takes this very seriously alright so you are you guys are mobile friendly the website design is mobile friendly I just want to throw that in there because it's definitely one of the top four things Google looks at okay so um, with all that being said I hope that makes sense um, I hope that SEO marketing makes sense for you guys uh, corporate business um, if you guys have any questions please feel free um, I'd love to sit down and have a conversation with you guys about it and get a proposal together and see about getting at least Encinitas um, on the map more and get more at least you know 100 200 and take the whole uh, you know the whole city eventually There's 60,000 people in Encinitas and it's getting searched 1600 times a month so definitely huge potential uh, to bring me more people in the door and get more membership so um, I appreciate the guy the time you guys took to watch this video um, and you guys have a nice day thank you